Okay, we've got our Honda CRF 150F engine out of the frame. This particular engine is from a 2007 model. We're getting ready to disassemble this for the repair manual production. And we thought we'd just shoot a few video clips just to uh, go over some of the parts and what we find in here. And of course, if you are going to work on one of these engines and you need step-by-step -step instructions we will have our repair manual up shortly that'll have everything all the pictures we take and then you can ask questions through our tech support system if you need to all right our top end disassembly is complete um, if you're not familiar of the components of a four-stroke engine in the top end here's an example of what's in the crf 150f top end you start with your valve cover, you'll have your cam chain tensioner, bolts for your cylinder head, your rocker arm assembly which holds the rocker arm and rocker arm shafts. The camshaft also rides in there and then that makes the rockers move which opens and closes the valves. You have your camshaft sprocket you're gonna have an assortment of dowel pins, bolts, retainers. You have your cylinder head itself, the, the top of the valves and the valve springs. That is your valves here where they seal the cylinder head. You got your intake valve, which is larger, and your exhaust valve, which is smaller. Your cylinder here. Then you'll have your piston and the wrist pin that it rides on and then the circlips always keep track of those they're easy to lose they can fall down in the engine that that retains the the wrist pin in the piston next we're going to remove our clutch cover and go through the components inside there so we've removed our clutch cover we have all the pieces out from the right side of the engine. You got your centrifugal oil filter, oil pump drive gear, your clutch components, the gear shift linkage, and the oil pump. So now we're gonna head over to the left side of the engine and remove all those parts. The left side engine components have now been removed. Um, we got some of our electrical system lives over here. We took off our neutral switch. There's our stator and our pickup coil. The flywheel and the starter clutch, starter reduction gear. The starter motor needed to go, so we popped that off. We have our cam chain, the other cam chain guide and next we're going to split the cases get the uh, crankshaft and the transmission out and that'll be the entire engine disassembly all right we have separated our crankcase halves and we have removed the transmission and the shift forks the shift drum and the crankshaft itself which is the last major component to come out of this engine so we will, like I mentioned earlier, have all these pictures and step-by-step -step instructions with the tech support in our manual.